Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. FPS render template today I'm gonna show you guys how to do it because a lot of people have been questioning like dude can you explain me your 50 FPS render template today I'm gonna show you guys how to do that because everyone was like dude you promised it for two freaking weeks two freaking weeks you have been promising this freaking template so today we're gonna do this what's up guys my name is Alex welcome to this uh, new soon event tutorial it's Wednesday and actually you know don't mind you know the, the the very random intro I was just feeling like I'm just gonna start the video like a little different than I usually but today I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys how to freaking the 50 FPS render template because a lot of people have been questioning like I said before dude can you run through all of your settings you have so basically today we're gonna freaking do this so if you guys are stoked for this for today's video make sure to smash that like button down below and if you want to see more and you're new make sure to smash that like button down below because I have a lot of tutorials more to come so actually let's get just right into the video okay guys so basically as you guys can see this is a Sony Vegas tutorial that I created yesterday actually this wasn't a Sony Vegas tutorial it was a OBS tutorial so my bad as you if you want to See that video the link is in the description of yesterday's uh, uh, OBS tutorial and as you guys can see this is just a project like everything like when I just edited you know this is like the, the, the upcoming intro like, as you can see it's just this um, template all kind of stuff so this video is recorded in 50 FPS and I'm just gonna render this out again just to show you guys actually as you, as you can see the freaking timeline everything is freaking cut I'm gonna show you guys my 50 FPS render template because as you guys can see I render out a 50 FPS 1080p and if you guys wanted so bad I'm just gonna create a new video so basically you want to put up this video when you're done editing you also want to make sure your video is filmed in 50 fps so you can render it out in 50, 50 fps that's actually what i can talk that's actually the point if you have your video recorded in 60 fps you also want to render it out in 60 fps i prefer 50 fps so i'm just going to select everything as you can see um from my timeline so this is all this is the entire project i'm going to select everything boom and first of all, I'm going to show you guys this um, this template. As you can see, YouTube 50 FPS. It's not in there for Vegas. I just named this YouTube 50 FPS. Those are the first settings. So as you guys can see, we have the width and uh, the height. That's just, you know, a 1080p standard resolution. Then the frame rate, you want to pick 50 double panel. Boom, like this. You all, you guys want to, like, open this up, this video, in a, on your second monitor so you can cop everything in it. So basically, as you can see, the frame rate is 50. Uh, the stereoscopic 3D model is just off. Um, the actual pi the pixel format is 8-bit. View transform is just off, as you can see. The full resolution rendering quality, it, you would put that on best. You know, I think standard it's on good, but you want to put it on best. Motion blur type is just Gaussian, and the overlays method is just blend field. And the deinterlace method is just blend fields. Adjust source media to better match project or render settings. You want to click this one, boom. Then maybe you can, this is optional if you want to start all your projects with these settings. I'm just going to click yes, click on apply. And you also want to do this before rendering. So always go to this icon as you can see this one put your 50 FPS on it and then render it out So as you guys can see we're done with this part and I'm just gonna go to file like you would normally do Then you want to click on a render as I'm gonna show you guys the format and the settings So basically a lot of people say you got you need to render it out in mp4 or mpeg2 wav or avi I would just say just use wmv windows media video Just use we just use the windows media video Fuck windows media video So basically, once you go, you want to open up this tab, as you can see, boom, and you want to pick your 1080p preset, like just this one, pick this one, you know, with the highest uh, Mbps, click on customize template, you want to go over to a video, and this is actually my, those are my settings, you want to go to video, and I'm going to show you guys my um, presets, so I'm going to close this out, you guys need to keep this window open, I'm just going to use my um, template, I'm just going to get on customize template, click on video, this is what you guys need to copy, you need to copy everything, this is what I use, this is like, those are just the settings of my presets, so as you guys can see, I'm just going to run through it, 
um, so you guys can do it with me. So the mode is just CBR. The format is Win Windows Media Video 9. Uh, the image size is high definition, as you guys can see. The video width is 1440 by 1080. Don't ask me why, but this is just what I use. Pixel aspect radio, I want to put this one on uh, this one, not on square. But the, the frame rate, you want to put, you, you just want to put in 50. The seconds per keyframe is five. You want to check this one and you want to fill in three and the video smoothness you want to put this one to sharpest the sharpest possible the best quality possible that's basically your set for this part so let's go to the bitrate tab and um you just want to you know internet land you just want to put in 8m some people prefer 12 but i would just say dude just put in 8m because as you guys can see my quality is really good well it's not always the best but my quality is really good so you guys want to just fill in what i have and then you want to go to the next tab you don't want to do anything with this and then your project and you want to also full video rendering quality you want to also put this one on best and then and just the color space you want to get that on default and your stereoscopic 3d mode is just use project settings you can go back to the audio and you want to pick your um, attributes you want to go to the bottom and you want to pick this one this is the best quality you can ever have 320 this is going to be really poor quality you know this low you just want to go to 320 kbps pick that one and basically you want to click on ok now that you made the template you probably have it like on the top you just want to uh, again customize it and you want to give it your template a name so i just use my you know i give my template a youtube 50 fps template that's just what i filled in i just pressed on this little icon that saves it i just don't click on ok that's as simple as this. that is how that's what i use and as you can see i have the same for 60 fps if i ever gonna switch to 60 fps you know filming in 60 fps i might just change to this one and maybe in the future and like i don't know uh, if i ever have to film in 4k i also had also made a preset for that so i'm actually pretty set on presets and i hope you guys are too i hope this video was helpful to you if it was helpful make sure to smash the like button and let me know in the comments thank you guys for watching it's really it's, it's really simple guys if this video went by too fast just rewind it and just pause it wherever you want it so thank you guys for watching thank you guys thank you guys for the continued support i want to see i will see you guys uh tomorrow for a new reaction to world videos episode 2015 is almost over so i got a lot of more tutorials coming in 2016 so thank us and i'll catch you guys tomorrow or i'll see you guys next week wednesday for news in the vegas tutorial so i'll catch you guys next week okay so the first thing is that you don't want to do in your car playing around with your cell phone drop comments down below and i'll be more happy to make a video about it. my own clothing line through the description down below even if you're not a subscriber correctly and quickly twitter verification process you can find a link down below i'm done with this kind of shit opportunity is there as long as you guys keep watching my videos i will keep making them